My name is Steven Zanfrano, I'm the head coach here at TriFit Wellness, and today we're gonna go over some variations that we see commonly in the gym for our deadlifts. So, whether you're using a barbell, dumbbell, kettlebell, whatever, the form is going to be similar. So with our RDL, Romanian deadlift, it's a stiff leg deadlift. That doesn't mean we hyperextend the knees. The knees are still soft a little bit, but you start from the top here, so I'm holding the bar up nice and tall. I'm gonna hinge down, keeping the legs relatively straight, so it's a lot of hamstring on this one. And I'm gonna squeeze my glutes to bring my hips forward. Coming down, RDL. Notice my feet are really close together. My legs are relatively straight, not locked out. Next, we've got our sumo deadlift. So sumo, bring the feet one and a half to two times the distance of the hips. So a little far. We don't need to point the toes out very far. Maybe just 10 degrees with the toes out slightly. The knees are what's gonna go out. So with our sumo deadlift, it's just a wide stance deadlift. Same as our RDL, we're nice and tall. We're gonna push those knees wide as our hips go back, back, back. Right there, keep your back nice and flat. Hamstrings and glutes are working to pull up and in, just like the RDL. But now you can see my feet and legs are a lot wider. Okay, the last variation we do quite commonly is a single leg deadlift. So again, you can do dumbbells, barbell, whatever you need, but we'll do a single leg deadlift. Commonly, I'll even have a client keep their foot down here as a staggered deadlift. It'll help, helps with balance a little bit, but uh, a single leg, keeping the knee soft, just like an RDL, core tight. We're gonna hinge, hips back, reach your foot behind you, and squeeze your glutes to come on up. So, here are three common deadlift variations. No matter the variation, we're gonna make sure we have a ground contact, really firm ground contact with the foot, and core engaged. Really important.